the reason it is, average person, not overweight or lean, we are recommending around 2,000 calories a day. Do you know what the level of producing calorie it is here by agriculture? 3,900 calories per person per day. So where do you think the other uh, 1,000 extra calorie goes? Goes to the food industry as a very cheap or free, and they make a product, and we buy it. That's where the problem is. I've been telling my students, anytime you want to see if there is a problem, go to your uh, photo album of your grandparents to see if there was any overweight or obese grandma or grandpa. They never been. The reason it was, they were buying the fresh fruit and vegetable or they were planting it themselves. So that's where to answering your question. Yeah. Now, having an extra calorie on board and the food industry taking advantages of that and just marketing it a very cheap way. I mean, if you see the kids, yeah, yeah I mean, the, just if you go to a grocery store, look at the cereal aisle, what do you see? In the lower level is all of the junk cereals with the kids pictures of Michael Jackson, Michael Jordan, everybody else. <laughs> the good cereal, they are on the really top. Nobody can catch them. Is there any? Well, if there, there are some, I mean, the, the, is the education gets there. The education, but I know it, some people, they know it. The other people, I've been watching the kids, they come, can I get this, can I get that? It's nothing, just sugar. As a result, you have problems with the bones, you have everything, cardiovascular disease. We are seeing, you know, uh, as Dr. Young was saying, that we are seeing adult disease in the kids now. So that's where the problem comes. That's where I go back. The best weapon is education, to have this kind of discussion all the time, to make a firm decision. Otherwise, all of these decisions, they come and go. If you are not firm and you are not believe on it, is not going to work.